Hi everyone and welcome back to another video on my YouTube channel. Um, I know it's been a long time since I've uploaded a video. Actually the last video I uploaded was probably back in June when I just got back from my Disneyland Paris trip. And I have just gone on another Disneyland Paris trip and I just got back um, yesterday. So um, yeah, I have another haul coming up for you guys. Um, I don't really have inspiration for other YouTube videos so... I'll just probably stick to hauls for now. Um, but I went to Disneyland Paris um, for the Lion King season, the Lion King and the Jungle um, Festival. Uh, the Lion King is my absolute favorite Disney movie, so it meant a lot for me to be able to go there um, again and so soon. Um, this time I went with my mom and I got a bunch of souvenirs. Not as much as I did last time because I was kind of on a budget, but this time I did get quite a few things and stuff that I saw and I just had to get. So I'm gonna like show everything to you. So um, I'm probably gonna start with one of the, the stupidest things I've ever bought, um, but it's something that I would have loved to get as a kid. And since I've never went to Disneyland as a to Disneyland as a kid, I was like, well, I want one now to take cute photos with and because I just really want one, you know, like to have it in my room and to put it up when it when it's um, empty. So I got a huge Minnie Mouse balloon. Um, I'm not even sure if you can put it entirely. Yeah, it's pretty big and it was 10 euros. But since I got an annual pass this trip, it was only 8 euros for me. And it also says that it's an exclusive Disneyland Paris product. And I just thought she was really cute. And she did make, um, like, she was fun to make a cute, a couple of Instagram pictures with. I'm sorry, I can't speak. I've had a very long day. Um, but yeah. I do not regret getting this. I thought it was really cute. And for eight euros, I was like, well, I'm just gonna get one, you know? I'm just gonna do it. And when it's um, empty, it'll make cute, it'll make really cute room decor. So yeah, I got a big Minnie Mouse balloon. The other thing that I got, which is kind of pointless, but I just, I've seen this on a bunch of trips and every time I wanted it, my one of my parents was like, well, it's a really expensive thing to buy and it's kind of stupid, so don't buy it. And this time I was like, you know what, fuck it, I'm hungry, I want popcorn. And then I saw this Cinderella carriage that I've been after for such a long time. And I was like, you know what, this time I'm just gonna get it. So this is a popcorn bucket and it's actually ridiculously expensive because it's 25 euros with popcorn and 24 euros without popcorn. I did get it with popcorn because I was really like in a mood for popcorn. Um, normally, I think I would get it without popcorn because it would get it's it gets all sticky on the inside. But at the same time, for only one euro more, you have a lot of popcorn, so it's a better deal to get it with popcorn. Um, but yeah, it comes with this key cord thing that's blue and has like stars on it, and um, it's a Cinderella carriage, and it also it, it drives like the wheels move. And it also opens up and then in here they fill a popcorn. There's actually like a very good amount of popcorn in here when you buy it. Like there's a lot of popcorn in there. So like it's it's a pretty good deal, but still it's it's a really expensive popcorn bucket, obviously. But yeah, I really love it. And I'm just gonna put it next to my yellow bug model from Emma from Once Upon a Time. So I have cute fairy tale like vehicles. I don't know, I really like it. So I have that one. Um, one of the other, like, the smaller things I got were pins. The first day we went into Disney Village and I saw this Frozen pin. And Frozen's one of my favorite Disney movies and I didn't have a Frozen pin yet. So I thought it's, I saw this Olaf one and I was like, you know, I'm gonna get it. Um, it's a green pin, which I think is 7 euros. And with my discount, I get 20% off all the merch, which is really nice. But it doesn't go on like the popcorn bucket because it's not in a shop and you have to get it at, like a stand outside on Central Plaza. So you don't get discount on that. But you do get discount on like the merch in the shops. So I got this Olaf pin which is really cute. And then the pin I got on the last day, I really wanted to get the seasonal pin, like for the Lion King and Jungle Festival, 
um, and I saw one on my first day. And then I was like to my mom, okay, I, I've seen that, I'm just gonna get it later. And then when I went two days later to do my final purchases, it was gone. So I got this Lion King one instead, and it just has Simba, Pumbaa, and Timon on there. Uh, this was an orange pin, which is 8 euros. Um, and yeah, I thought this was really cute. I do not wear my pins on my lanyard in the parks because it personally really annoys me because they get really heavy when you put a lot of pins on there. But I do like collecting the pins. So I have eight pins now. Um, so yeah, I think it's really cute to collect pins. Um, another small thing that I got were these new pens. Um, there are six ball pens and they have like the rides on there. So. You have a Disneyland Paris one, which has Minnie and Mickey on it. You have a Pirates of the Caribbean one with Stitch. You have a Ratatouille one with, obviously, Remy and Emil. Um, you have a Tower of Terror one with Pluto and I think it's Goofy. And then you have a Matt Hatter teacup thing with Grumpy and Dopey. And you have a Hyperspace Mountain thing with Darth Vader. Probably, I'm gonna use these at some point, but I don't know when I'm gonna use these. But, like, the only one I'm not a big fan of is the Star Wars hyperspace one because I'm personally not a big Star Wars fan. But the rest of them I thought were really cute. And this was 12 euros, um, which I think, I mean, it is a lot for pens because it, it when you count it down, it's 2 euro per pen. Which is a lot because when you go to a normal shop, you pay, like, 5 euros. No, not even 5, you pay, like, 2 euros for an entire set of, like, 10 pens. But... Uh, the other Disney pens were like six euro each, so I was like, well, okay, this is six of them for 12, so I'm just gonna get it. Um, so yeah, I got that. Um, another thing that I got on my first day were these Simba ears. Um, as I mentioned, I love the Lion King, I adore Simba, and I just needed to have these Simba ears for the new season. Um, these were, I think they were 14 euros? But I'm not really sure. I got a discount on them, so for me they were they were like 11 euro something. Um, they have paws on the side, and it also says Disneyland Paris. I don't know if you can see, but it says Disneyland Paris on there. Um, so yeah, I thought these were really re were really cute, and I just had to get them for the season. So I have those. Um, the other pair of mouse ears that I got were these Briar Rose Gold ones. I think they're called. I already have rose gold ears, but I just thought these were gorgeous. And these are so much more comfortable than the rose gold ears I had from last year. So, um, I actually really like, uh, like these, and I'm really happy that I got them. Um, these were 20, so there were 16 with my discount, I think. Um, this is a thing that I got not at Disney itself. I got it at the Primark shop in Val d'Europe, which is a big shopping center near Disney. We went there on the first day to do some groceries from the parks and to eat at McDonald's. So, um, I went to Primark and I, th I saw this shirt and it just says Minnie Mouse and then it says 100k likes and then it says be your best self. And I thought, was, I thought this was really cute, especially because I was going to Disney and I personally feel like my best self when I'm at Disney. So I, I thought for 8 euros, I'm just going to get these. I'm just going to get this. So it was 8 euros and I didn't get a discount on this, obviously, because it's not a Disney Parks shop. But it was cheap, so I got it anyways. Um, One of the other... Oh, my cat has come in. Come. So, one thing that I got is this present. This was a present to me. Um, my mom uh, gave me this because I graduated high school this year. So she gave me this Disney necklace. And it has a really cute box with Mickeys all over it. I'm not sure if you can see it, but it's really cute. Um, and then it opens up and it has a castle necklace in there. Um, I meant, I've mentioned to her loads of times that Disney is my happy place and she went there with me this time to experience it with me and she had so much fun and she loved it. So she was like, I'm just going to get you this necklace because you graduate, graduated and it's super cute. It's basically, it's the castle with like little silver stones in there. Um, and I'm not sure how much this was. This was from the jewelry stand, jewelry stand and it is the color yellow. I'm not sure how much this 
this is because it was a present. Um, but yeah, I really love this. So mom, if you're ever watching this, I love you and thank you. Um, the other thing that I got is also something my mom suggested me to buy. And she actually paid for it, like I can pay her back later. Because she, she thought it was so accurate for me. So it's this sweatshirt that we found in the shop near Ratatouille. I think it's called Chez Marianne. Um, so yeah, we got this sweater. And it just says, oh, is my balloon doing okay? Yeah, it's doing okay. It's It just has the castle on there. And then it says, my happy place. And that is the most accurate thing ever for me. Because Disney is my happy place. It's the best place ever. <laughs> I just love it so much. And this was 40 euros. So with my discount, I think it was somewhere between 30 and 35. I'm not really sure. But, um... Yeah, I, I love this. It's such a cute thing and I'm gonna wear this loads of times. It's also kind of, um, it's not too Disney-ish, like it's not too in your face. It's it's pretty sober, it's pretty sober colors and then just the outlining of the castle. So it's really cute and sophisticated. Um, so now on to plushes. So one of the plushes I got is this one. It's a Mickey Mouse world's biggest mouse party and it says Disneyland Paris on there as well this was in the shops as a special offer for when you uh, spend over 20 euros you can get this one for six with your purchase and this was discounted down from 20 so normally I wouldn't spend 20 euros on such a small blush because he's he's pretty small but for six euros I just couldn't leave him there especially because it's the world's biggest mouse party and it's a limited edition it was for mickey's 90th birthday i just thought he was too cute and for six euros i just took him with me so this was six euros i'm not sure how long they're gonna have these probably until they run out um so yeah this is the mickey mouse mouse party plush um also from the same offer i got this uh, my my mom actually got this because on the first night she was cold i wanted to watch illuminations and it was going to rain and a rain cape was 11 euros but this blanket was also on a special offer because it's also uh, like the one i get rid of the collection i think but it was also six euros and it's the world's biggest mouse party blanket like a throw blanket and this was count discounted down from 20 as well so this used to be 20 and now it was six and my mom got it because she was cold and she was like well you know what i'm just not gonna do anything with this so uh after tonight you can have it so i basically got it for free like as a gift as well so i'm not sure if you can really see it because it's kind of big but yeah it just says disneyland paris in the corner and then it has mickey on there and it also says world's biggest mouse party in the corner I'm not sure if you can see it because it's it's really big and I can't really hold it up because I can't really, you know, go down. But it says World's Biggest Mouse Party and it has this fun Mickey design on there. And I thought it was really cute. So thank you, Mom, for this. I'm just going to use this loads of times. I used this when we were traveling back. Um, we stopped at a gas station and we went to get some snacks or something. And I just walked around like covered in this like as my comfort blanket because I love Disney and I was sad. So... Yeah, I mean, it's cute. So, the other two plushies that I got is this alien from Toy Story. So, recently I've been really obsessed with Toy Story. I love Toy Story, I always love Toy Story, but I really loved Toy Story aliens. I think they're so cute and so funny. Because my cat wants attention, I'm sorry. But, um, he's really cute. And I went on Buzz Lightyear for the first time and these were also in there and I saw this in a shop and I was like, you know, I didn't, I don't have a Toy Story plush yet so I'm going to get the alien from Toy Story. And this was 23 euros but with my discount I think it was 19 or 18, I'm not really sure. Um, but yeah, it's, it's a pretty small plush I, could, I would say but it's still really cute. So yeah, Toy Story alien. And then the other plush that I got is Donald because on my last trip I had a very fun character interaction with Donald and he was one of my most fun meets. Um, but last time I didn't have money anymore to buy a Donald plush and this time I saw him and I was like, you know, I don't have a Donald plush. 
and I do have Mickey and Minnie already, so I'm going to take this Donna plush with me. And he was 26 euros. He's pretty decent sized. I think his mouth looks a bit weird, but I mean, <laughs> he's still really cute. And I, I mean, it's the original duck. Like I, I just needed to have this for my collection. So Donald Duck. And then the last thing I got is also the biggest Disney thing I've ever got is this huge Minnie Mouse plush. This is the biggest plush that they sell. And they have these in Mickey, Minnie, and Stitch. Personally, I'm not a big Stitch fan, so it came down between Mickey and Minnie. And I love Minnie, so I just got a Minnie. And she is normally 80 euros, which isn't why I never bought these big plushes. But with my discount, she was 64. And, I mean, I love plushes and I love cuddling with plushes. So, this was my one big thing that I wanted to treat myself to this trip. Um, so, yeah, I got big Minnie Mouse and she's adorable and so cuddly. And I don't have room for her yet, but I'm going to make room. So, yeah. And, yeah, my trip to Disneyland was just the best as always. Um... I didn't get as much stuff as last time, but I'm still super grateful and it was a, an amazing trip. So I hope you enjoyed this video and if you do like my Disney content, please feel free to follow my Disney Instagram, which is called the same thing as my YouTube channel, Eve's Disney Life. Um, I will post loads of pictures on there from my last trip and videos and stuff like that so if you want to follow it please do and i hope you have a very wonderful day night wherever you are um so yeah bye